Hey guys, Greasy Bear here, and today I want to show you how I created my white room. So let's get started. I'm going to start with a cube, and I'm going to scale and position the cube. Then I'm going to apply a scale. I'm going to select this first face and delete it. I'm going to add a camera. I'm going to move the camera up to the center of the cube. Then I'm going to go to my camera view. Then I'm going to position the camera and stretch the room to match. Next, I'm going to put some cuts in here for some hallways. So I'm going to slide this cut down here, place it as a hallway. I'm going to add some more cuts. Next, I'm going to grab the faces and extrude that one out, extrude that one out, and I'm going to add a bevel. Next, I'm going to add a solidifier. I'm going to go to Kid Ops and I'm going to convert the mesh and now I'm able to start placing my inserts. Okay, now that I'm happy with my inserts, it's now time to start changing the materials to match that milky white room effect. Okay, next I'm going to tweak the camera and the scene for a better view. Yeah, that's much cooler. Next, I'm going to add some lights. These are basic area lights. I'm just duplicating them and moving them all around the scene. Very cool. Now I'm going to change the materials on the capsules and on the windows so they don't match. Next, I'm going to grab these faces here and I'm going to extrude the faces along the normals to make a little dent. Then I'm going to turn it to a darker material so it breaks off the white. Cool. So now I'm going to start placing my decals. And once the decals are placed, I'm going to change the color to match the scene a lot better. And just a couple more tweaks and tweak on the color. And that should be it. We're going to save the file and now we're going to render it. And there is our white room. Guys, I hope you like this video. And always thank you for your support. And I'll talk to you guys later.